Hello everyone. Welcome to this question of the day series. Today we are going to attempt a DI question from past year CAT paper. So this was a question based on uh, a scatter plot. Uh, the data points in the bigger uh, below figure represent monthly income and expenditure data of individual members of Ahuja family, the Bose family, Kumar family and the Dubey family. So these are the four families represented in the graph. So uh, it is given that savings is income minus expenditure. Even if they don't give you such a thing, you should know that savings is income minus expenditure. Okay. So the first, uh, the question which is asked is which family has the lowest average income? Right. Now, one common thing that people do is they calculate the values from the graph. They read the values from the graph and calculate the average. This is a time consuming process, right? You will read the values and then uh, add and then divide by the required number of family members. That's a time consuming process. This question can, could be asked just by observing the graph. So let's see how you can observe the graph and answer such questions. So let us look at the first family. Uh, this is the Ahuja family. Okay, so if you see this, this is one of the incomes. This is the second income. This is the third income. So income is indicated in this direction. So if you see the rough average, right? Uh, if you see the deviation, it is just as much higher as it is lower than this value. So average income of would be Ahuja family will be this much about this much, right? So you do not need to be accurate that whether it is 3000 or 2950, just take this value. Second is uh, the Bose family. So these are the three points. If you take the average, the average comes out to be roughly this. No need to calculate the values. Just observe the graph and measure. Then third is the Kumar family. So this, this, this somewhere around here, whether it is 1700, 1600, you should not be worried about. This is of Kumar family. Then the fourth family is the Dube family. So if you see this is uh, one, this is the second one. So rough, rough, somewhere in between, this would be the line. I do not read the values, just see the center point. So you can just assume that this is the distance between the points. So center line will pass through this. So clearly you can see that Kumar family has the lowest income. So such questions could be answered just by observing the graph carefully. You do not need to read values from the graph. So make sure that if you get any such questions on graphs, try to observe the values and answer them rather than calculating the actual values. If necessary, then only go for the actual calculations.